All new at noon, a mother is safe along with her two kids after a close call with the fallen tree. 13 on your sides, Nathan Lee, live in Muskegon County after hearing from her and getting a first-hand look at the damage. Nathan, it's very stark damage behind you. Yes, absolutely. We're in northeast Muskegon at one of many road closures in the area. And behind me here is a great example of what these high winds can do. Let's take a look. We've got a couple of large trees that are completely blocking the roadway. It even looks like they snagged the power line on their way down. And take a look at this. This tree is hanging over the roadway after those storms and those winds came through. Now this sort of scene is everywhere over here. Just driving down the road, you can see trees falling on houses, uprooted from people's front yards, and of course, more of those downed power lines. Now one woman was on her way to work around 6 a.m. when a tree crashed through her windshield. She says the whole event happened in an instant. She heard a crack outside of her car, and her sunroof and windshield shattered. Now she and her two children got out of the vehicle unharmed. They say they're still a bit rattled. They were pretty scared. I yelled both. The first thing I did was yelled both their names. One was crying. Um, the other one just screamed that he was okay. <laughs> but yeah, they made it out pretty good. Right, Andy? Yeah. Now, people are out here doing their best to keep the roadways clear. I've seen neighbors with lifts and leaf blowers trying to clear all the branches they can off of the roadways. We'll make sure to keep you updated on those efforts as the day progresses. In Northeast Muskegon, Nathan Lee, 13 on your side.